guys, Diamond C250 here, and today I am back with another Minecraft video, and today I will be reviewing the items from Mods Mod. So yeah, anyway guys, let's get started. Okay guys, so you're going to need to find a weaponsmith, and once you find the weaponsmith, the weaponsmith will have all of the items, uh, and you can trade it for certain stuff to get those items. So yeah. So first, let's start with the weapons. Okay guys, so we have the Emerald Sword, the Steel Leaf Sword, the Steel Sword, the Lapis Sword, the Nano Saber, the Sword of the Wyvern, the Draconic Sword, and the Ironwood Sword. So yeah, so let's get into the arena and test it out on some mobs. Okay guys, so you are going to need to go into Adventure Mode uh, or get away from grass because these do replace flowers just like the astronomic expansion right here. So yeah, let's try the Sword of the Wyvern. Okay, so it is very effective against these skeletons. Oh, I, I accidentally killed that cat. Sorry. Anyway, so, uh, yeah, this is a pretty cool weapon. Um, the other ones, I mean, uh, yeah, I'm going to spawn some more mobs so I can test this out, so... Let's test out the Nano Saber. The nan oh, the Nano Saber does a ton of damage. I think that's one hit, right? Yeah, so the Nano Saber is pretty cool. The Sword of the Wyvern, it just gets. Uh, yeah, that's kind of like the Dragon Sword in the Astronomic Expansion add on. If you haven't seen that, uh, go check it out after this video. I recommend it, and it's kind of like this add on. But anyway, so let's try the Draconic Sword. Oh, the Draconic Sword is also one hit. Uh, the Lapis Sword, let's see, the Lapis Sword is also one hit, and the Steel Sword, um, I think the Steel Sword is also one hit, and then the Steel Leaf Sword, it makes you go a bit faster, so it may not be one hit, um, uh, okay, come on, uh, there we go, okay, yeah, it's two hit, because it makes you faster and gives you extra health. Okay, and then let's try the Emerald Sword. Okay, yeah, so the Emerald Sword, all of these swords are pretty powerful. Uh, I think, I think all of them are better than diamonds. I'm not sure. So, yeah, let's check out the other stuff. Okay, guys, so let's try out the new armor. Okay, so one, two, three, four. Do we have everything on? Yes, yeah, so this armor makes you super fast. It is the Quantum Armor. And, yeah, that is just unbelievably fast. So, I think I'm going to keep on some of it. I don't want to go super fast. I only want to go kind of fast. Well, hmm, hmm. Okay, here. I'll, I'll just leave it at this. So, therefore, I'm not going super fast. I'm just get extra health and stuff. But, yeah, that was really cool. And, um, let's see what other items we have in here. Okay, so these are the ingots that you can use to create the weapons. Okay, this should be interesting. So he here are the pickaxes. We have the atomic disassembler, we have the lapis paxel, and then we have the steel paxel. So let's see how these work. Okay, so I'm going to try it on the stone. So it mines kind of quickly. As you can see, it's not doing hand animation, which is a bit weird. But, I mean, it mines at decent speed. Uh, yeah, I think it's pretty fast. Maybe the diamond pickaxe is a bit faster. I'm not sure. Lapis Pax Earl is a bit faster. Now, let's try the atomic disassembler. Seems like it's going to be good. Um, yeah, that's, that's pretty fast, I guess. Um, oh yeah, I, I see how this works. It gives you haste. Okay. So, if you can, okay. So, I kind of get how that works. Okay, so we have the Force Mitt. I believe it maybe gives you extra damage. Uh, I'm not sure. Let's see. Uh, okay. Okay, so we have the Force Mitt. Um, I guess that just like, gives you extra damage or something. I don't know. And then we have the Chisel, and this replaces the Wooden Axe, so you can like you use it on the on a tree and I, I guess that kind of makes sense so let's try some other things so okay let's try the new blocks 
Okay, so first we have this block, like it's kind of like a variation of a wooden block, I guess. That would actually be good for like floor tiles, because you know, kind of looks. Yeah, yeah, that kind of looks like floor tiles. That that looks pretty good. Or maybe that kind of looks like wooden bricks. I know that's not really a thing, but whatever. Okay, and then they, these these would also be kind of like it's like smooth polished wood. These kind of look like they could work for tiles also. Uh, let's see this. The so, awakened draconium block. Oh, that, that's really cool. It's like, like a flame. Hmm. Yeah. I guess that's a flame. That looks pretty cool. The draconium block is, I mean, it's probably just put it. It looks like it's from the ingots. Then we have the red stone brick. There's also a yellow version. So I lost it somehow. But yeah, so so that, that would be pretty good for, like, maybe a weird looking building. Or, or maybe like a fire, a fire truck or a fire, I, I'm not sure. So yeah, those are the new blocks, let's see what else there is. Okay guys, so I think if the water essence um, increases your health, then the fire essence increases your damage, and then the earth, or no, the earth one increases your damage, and then the fire one increases your speed. So yeah, that is about it for the items from mods add-on. And so let's try the multi-craft add-on. Okay guys, we have the multi-craft add-on. This is supposed to be compatible with the items from mods add-on and it kind of is though. Um, the stuff from the items of mods add-on doesn't work that well if you put it below the multi-craft add-on but anyway let's start reviewing this so hmm okay let's start off with these first weapons we have the soul dagger the steel sword the bronze sword the iron multi-tool the bronze multi-tool steel multi-tool this any energy cord and then i don't think the water shard does anything so that's all we are going to review for today's video so yeah let's review these tools and then yeah i think the video will be over so yeah okay i forgot to mention that for this you're going to need the education edition um uh turned on for multi-craft to work so let's try the iron multi-tool so this um let's see um it just gives you okay so it, it's okay for mining Whereas this, well, oh, huh, that's weird. Okay, uh, I'll, I think it's because like these effects last for 120 seconds. But anyway, so let's try the iron multi tool. Iron multi tool is okay. Bronze multi tool. So I'm assuming since it's like a multi tool, you can use it. Uh, uh, you can fight with it as well as mining with that. So. That's pretty cool. Um, let's see, does the energy cord do, do anything? Can't be placed, it can't really be thrown. Okay, no, it doesn't. Um, yeah, so let's try the different swords on some mobs. So the steel sword. Um, okay, so, so, so I think the steel sword looks to be as strong as the diamond sword because it's two hits. Oh, oh, well, hmm, maybe. This, uh, the steel sword's pretty strong, and then the soul dagger, um, let's see how, how that is. Okay, I don't know why I placed the barrier blocks there. Uh, let's use that to, to get up. Okay, okay guys, so let's try out the weapons on here. Okay, so, um, so, uh, ah, <laughs> okay. Um, this is... Oh, I think that's... A, oh, so this is actually less powerful than a diamond sword because I kind of get it because, like, it's, it's bronze. And, okay, and then the steel sword. Okay, oh, that's cool. The steel sword is one hit, so it's a pretty good weapon. Um, let's try the soul dagger. Hmm. Okay, oh, wait. Is that... Is that just me or is it setting them on fire? I'm not sure. But that's pretty cool. Um, let's see if the multi-tool does any damage. Hmm. One, two. Ah, three. Okay, so I, I think it does some extra damage. That's pretty cool. 
Okay guys, so I think that is about it for today's video. Thank you all for watching. Make sure to leave a like if you did enjoy the video and subscribe for more of this type of content. I'm going to try to get part two out next week. But anyway guys, goodbye.